Hello guys and welcome back to World of Tanks with Bandy. Today uh, we have a uh, uh, second part of my Type 64 uh, Why You Should Buy it Mini Series. Uh, today I want to show you a uh, gameplay uh, of uh, this tank on Prohoroka Encounter. I spawned from the southern side and I'm going from F1 Bush which is really a good tip for all of you guys uh, trying to solve those damn missions where you need to passively spot the enemies and not get spotted this is the bush from the southern side on Prohoroha which uh, will in 90% of time will work it will only not work if uh, some people manage to blind, sh blind shot you because all all of good players know for this bush and know that uh, scouts love to come over here but in loads of games uh, you are going to play against not so good players uh, that don't know how to play it by the way that was my first game and uh, instead of uh, actively scouting uh, on the ridge line which i'm going to show you in some other video with some other light tank this tank, uh, this tank also can do an uh, active role. Uh, it's a really fast machine, uh, good uh, ton per, per horsepower ratio. It has, uh, but in this game, uh, I was probably chasing some mission where uh, I needed to passively uh, scout and spot, spot uh, enemy tanks. So this is the reason because of the ultra camping also I saw that I have uh, enough people on the ridge line uh, to do an active uh, scouting role I was shooting through the bushes and through the trees you should also do it every time you can that way you can shoot the enemy and they cannot uh, uh, know really from where uh, you're getting uh, uh, hits on them um, I played this game uh, last winter uh, with my friend Robbie. Uh, he was playing his IMX 12T, and this is the period where we grinded our uh, damage and kills for the VZ 111, that uh, event marathon tank. And um, yeah, I took the bush, uh, he took uh, the ridge line to actively spot. Um, we have few tanks on the right side and few tanks on the left side. Uh, we have KV-4 over here, which you're gonna see in the moment later on. He's gonna be mad at me because I'm not charging in, in certain death. Like my friend did, because uh, he didn't have the patience in that game to wait a bit more. Uh, he wanted to, s to spot some guys in those bushes uh, but uh, no luck for him because they managed to kill him before he even spotted anybody. Uh, I will just uh, uh, shortly say uh, some basic info that I already mentioned in my uh, tank review of this tank but it's a, it's a good thing uh, because this is a why you should buy it video. Uh, the base uh, view range of this tank is uh, 390 I'm using uh, binoculars, coated optics and medium caliber gun rammer why I use those three it's because binos help me to boost my view range when I'm sitting in the bush and passively scout spotting coated optics give me 10% uh, bonus view range while on the move and thirdly medium gun uh, rammer it helped me out to boost my uh, raw rate of fire which is pretty damn good it's 18.18 .18. uh, the penetration is not that bad for tier 6 light tank it's uh, 128 and with gold APCR shells is uh, 177 with an average damage of 115 damage uh, the aiming time is not that bad, that's why I didn't uh, uh, put Tenkan's gun lane drive for this tank because it's uh, 2.1 uh, 
uh, aim time and dispersion on 100 meters is uh, 0 0.4 which is not that good but uh, you can make this tank uh, work with this gun you, you can make it work you can see all of my other type 64 videos uh, you uh, tend to um, get the connection with with the tank with every other tank by the way that was my kill number two if i'm correct and um, you can make it work even with that uh, awful dispersion of um, heavy tank now uh, here i because uh, we basically cleaned up this forest uh, part and this imx that was causing us problem has retreated by the way i need to mention that arty was doing their job so uh, this game uh, was way easier because they pummeled uh, some tanks uh, and i decided in this situation that uh, i need to go and spot for kv4 the this uh, railway uh, crossing for him because he already used his armor to be spotter for me on those T44s and uh, AMXs. Uh, now I spotted uh, this tiger. He doesn't. He he's fixating on KV4, but uh, I don't know. He he could at least shot me once, but uh, hey, free damage. I don't care. Um, now the situation is even more better for us because we are cornering them into one part of the map which is always bad for for team uh, that is playing from the north if they get cornered in this part of the map the game is pretty much over i found some rt to play with and i was happy yeah happy for the second i was thinking i'm gonna get more kills uh, but rt kill stealed and then I decided to kill steal this guy <laughs> for some from somebody else. Um, you can see that only few tanks are alive. KV4, KV3, AMX, uh, RT, and, and uh, uh, heavy. So I decided to go for RT and probably try to spot somebody from this position. You can see that this tank can shift uh, really, really good it's a really mobile machine um, i i don't have enough uh, praising for it the only only thing which can be really bad is this if you encounter some really 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 um, heavy tank which is kv3 in this situation and angled like this i will not penetrate him even with with gold shooting him in the ass that's the problem and RNG can be really harsh on you uh, because of that but uh, well your job isn't to kill a KV3 only 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 if you if you stay alone with him at the end of the battle then you praise for the gods load load APCR and praise pray for the best but all others uh, uh, but all other uh, tanks are uh, pretty much okay uh, for type 64 to penetrate it's not a, a really big in, big of an issue and uh, yeah mm, I was chasing Arty over here trying and praying for my uh, possible fourth kill because uh, you also need to know one thing that uh, uh, kills spotting damage uh, and damage all of those things are giving you uh, loads of credits now by the way that was a really derpy moment uh, i managed to uh, fail to penetrate with apcr uh, shell that uh, guy uh, in post game results you can see that this was my mastery badge 80 80k credits 3000 experience uh, on detailed report uh, on team battle report uh, you you saw that uh, i managed to do really well uh, did loads of damage um, and uh, yeah at at the end uh, you can see that i did uh, 2k damage almost 3k uh, spotting damage 
and it was a profit of uh, 63 uh, K of credits with uh, non premium account it would be around 40 K so yeah it's a really really good machine uh, if you if you know how to play scouts and light tanks uh, it's a real credit maker just like IMX uh, 1357 the new tank which I also uploaded uh, 10 days ago on something like that and yeah for no further ado uh, if you like the tank buy it it's around 15 euros on EU server uh, I don't know how much it cost on other servers but it's worth it uh, and uh, yeah thank you guys for watching like share comment on a video subscribe if you liked uh, my videos as well and I see you soon